Hello and welcome to this video where we're going to be focusing on the hardness testing of plastics. So sure or durometer hardness testing. The hardness of plastics is most commonly measured by the Shaw test, or not commonly known as durometer test, or Rockwell hardness test. Both methods measure the resistance of plastics towards indentation and provide an empirical hardness value that doesn't necessarily correlate well to other properties or fundamental characteristics of polymers. Shore hardness, using either the Shore A or Shore D scale, is the preferred method for rubbers or elastomers and is also commonly used for softer plastics. The Shore A scale is used for softer rubbers, while the short D scale is used for the harder ones. Many other short hardness scales such as short O and short H hardness do exist but are rarely used. So short hardness is tested with an instrument called a durometer. The durometer utilizes an indenter loaded calibrated spring. The measured hardness is determined by the penetration depth of the indenter under the load. Two different indenter shapes and two different spring loads are used for the Shore A and Shore D scales. The loading forces of Shore A are 1.812 pounds or 822 grams, and Shore D is 10 pounds, which equates to 4,536 grams. So let's have a quick look at the diagram on the right hand side here, where we can see the Shore A and Shore D indenters with a diagram showing how the load is applied and what the indentation looks like with a depth measurement on the left hand side here. Here are some more shore hardness examples. Now the shore hardness value may vary in the range from 0 to 100. Maximum penetration for each scale is 0 0.097 to 0 0.1 each. Or if we convert that to millimetres, it's 2.5 to 2.54 millimetres. This value corresponds to minimum shore hardness, which is zero, or a maximum hardness value of 100 corresponds to zero penetration. This chart below is a more visualisation of the hardness and some typical applications which are shown below. On the left hand side we have the super soft or extra soft, whereas on the right hand side we have the extra hard. So don't forget to check out our other videos in this plastic series and you can always contact us where there's a link below if you need any help with your projects at all in China. Oh and don't forget to like this video, also you can share it and make sure you subscribe to our channel. And the little bell on the right hand side here, if you hit that, that'll give you a notification every time we upload some new content. So thanks very much for listening. My name is Paul Adams from Soft East.